What's good, y'all? Hey, Saturday, June 18th, I'll be hosting my very first meet and greet here in Atlanta, Georgia. If you live near Atlanta, Georgia, be sure to pull up on me at Pot City Market near the Bell Line starting at 3 p.m. Everybody who comes automatically gets featured on my YouTube channel, and also, you get a special grand prize from yours truly. I don't care if one person shows up, two people show up. Bro, let's turn up for my 22nd birthday. What's good? Wait. <sighs> Wait, what's wrong with my camera? <sighs> there we go. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, let me let me let me start the intro over. What's good, y'all? It's your boy L A R O C K hey! back for another video. As you guys can tell, your boy got some brand new visuals. You know what I'm saying? I got the brand new camera, the Sony ZV E10. You know, if you wanna go buy that, go go cop it. You know what I'm saying? This camera is pretty nice. You know what I'm saying? I get I get close. I, I can get far. I get close again. You know what I'm saying? But hey, today I'm about to vlog with my new camera. Nigga. Shut up. Now, I'm not sure if you guys do know, but I've been taking acting classes for about almost a year now. I'll say since like at least last October, I've been taking I've been taking acting classes, guys. Like every Sunday I've been going, you know, taking <laughs> Every Sunday I've been taking acting classes, bro, and I, I just want to bring you guys along my journey. I I I I thought about, you know, vlogging it before, but I haven't done it. So, today I'm actually going to I'm I'm going to vlog for you guys. Here's my first scene. Um I memorized all these lines. I, I every everything that you see right here, I memorized it. I know it. This sounds crazy, right? I got two different scenes that I'm acting, so I mean, it's a challenge, but hey, I'm all for it. You know, it's fun. I love I love acting. I love portraying a character. And in today's vlog, I'm going to show you guys how I act. But I'm not going to lie. I'm tired as hell. It's about 3 o'clock in the morning. I just got off of Twitch. If you guys don't follow me on Twitch, be sure to follow me on Twitch. I'll be live streaming every freaking day. Well, not every day, but you know what I mean. Yeah, guys, I'm literally about to lay my ass down. I'm about to go to sleep. Um, And I'll see y'all tomorrow. All right, y'all. Um, I currently just woke up. And once again, I'm always late to acting class, so we got to go, okay? So, come on, let's go. Yo, I'll see you later. Even? Yeah, I'm going to acting class. All right. All right. Grab some water. All right, y'all, this to fit, you know what I'm saying? Got the little Arizona t-shirt, white skinny jeans. And some shoes I got from, uh, where did I get these shoes from? I think it was like AliExpress. I, some some website, I don't know, but they were like $30, so I copped them. But hold on, here's my fit. I'm gonna show you my fit real quick. This is my fit. You got the white skinny jeans, you know what I'm saying, with the shoes, you know what I'm saying? The shirt, you got the backpack, you know what I'm saying? Hey, we're ready, let's go. But yeah, like I said, bro, I'm so late to acting class. I'm always late, bro, but... It is what it is. <laughs> it's hot as hell. I ain't gonna lie. What time is it? What time? 154. I gotta be at class at two. So we got five minutes to get there. Let's hurry up. But yeah, also, man, I haven't ate anything at all. Like, I need to get something to eat. Usually, I'm not sure about you guys, but me, I don't usually eat breakfast, bro. I go days without eating breakfast. I don't really eat breakfast like that. I'm not a breakfast type of guy. Comment down below. Are you a breakfast type of guy? Do you eat breakfast? Because I don't eat breakfast like that. Sometimes I be in a rush, bro. I don't got time for breakfast. You know, I just got to eat whenever I got to eat, you know? So, hey, we'll focus on that later. But right now, we got to get to acting class. So, let's go. All right, y'all. I'm finally here. Like I said, I'm late. It's 2.10, bro. So, hopefully, my acting coach isn't mad. But you guys, today, you guys get to meet my acting classmates. My acting coach, I gotta put the door code in, hold on. But yeah, you guys get to meet my acting classmates. But you guys get to meet everybody today. And yeah, let's have a good class. I'm late as hell, but it's okay. Um, all the scenes I have seen have been in, are in really good shape. I'm uh, very excited, and Brittany has been doing something that I don't think we should all be doing. She's not waiting. <laughs> Alright y'all, as you can tell bruh, like when I vlog bruh, it's kind of awkward because I don't be vlogging in public like that and then people be looking at me like, why the fuck does he have a camera? So, I'm in the bathroom right now, uh, we're about to start in like 5 or 10 minutes. I'm going to record once I start my scene with my scene partner. And you guys want to see me act for the first time, you know? I have a showcase coming up um, 
June 7th through June 12th here in Atlanta, Georgia. So if you want to pop up, you can pop up. You know what I'm saying? Tickets are available. Um, but either way, I'm going to record it for those of you who can't make it out. So, yeah, I'm excited, man. We're just pre preparing for the showcase. Um, he said, like, a whole bunch of talent agencies are going to show up. Like, talent agencies, directors, producers. Like, you know, there's a possibility I can get signed or get noticed at least. You know what I'm saying? I'm not you know, putting my hopes up or anything, but either way, I'm still trying my best, you know? But let me get out of this stall, cause I'm the only one in the bathroom. Why, bro, I'm trying to fix my camera. Like, you see how it's like, it's so bright. I'm not gonna lie, I feel like getting sturdy right now. You know what I'm saying? Let me get sturdy in the bathroom. Here we go. Bruh, bruh. Okay, I'm done. Guys, comment down below. How good did I do? Was it good? Be honest. Like, honestly, I feel like I could have done better, but like, it was cool. You know what I'm saying? Sayla, how'd you feel about your scene? <laughs> I felt, I felt like it was good. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like I could have done better. Yeah, Sayla, I, I feel like I could have done better too. Yeah. Like, I feel like if, in my scene, I feel like I would just still like, I need to do more moving. Like, but I don't know. Did y'all do that like in your rehearsal? Like, talk about like. The yeah, but we haven't like like officially uh, like, like decided. Yeah. Okay. Well, once y'all do that, cause once you have the moving, you would feel comfortable because you know what you're doing. Like, yeah. If you don't know what you're doing. You, it's hard to like really go into the scene because you don't like know what you're supposed to be doing. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, to me, I feel like like right before I started, it was low key awkward, but I don't know. Really? I didn't see that. For me. Okay. I didn't see that. That's good though. That's good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You feel it more than he yeah. doesn't show though. Exactly. Exactly. Like, I don't know why, but every time before I start my scene, I always think, oh, I'm going to mess up, I'm going to mess up, and it doesn't happen. Really? Yeah. I feel that way sometimes. I don't know why it does that, but hey, comment down below. How did I do? Y'all let me know. Bro. All right, y'all. I just got done with class. You know what I'm saying? It, it, went, it went pretty good. Like I said, comment down below. How did I do? Me, personally, I feel like I could have done better, but hey, that's just, that's just how I'm thinking, but um, I'm about to go home if I can't find a move. Let me call Will and see what he's doing. Yo. What's up? What are you doing? What the f Is that a handprint? <laughs> I saw that on your story, yo. I just realized, like, if you truly believe you can have anything you want, just imagine you having that shit, and then all of a sudden, you have it. Bro, I'm telling you, that's why I got, bro, that's why I got, that's why I got a tattoo on my neck, bro. Bro, 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 the thing is, if you have, like, if you're scared of something happening, you're manifesting that shit, and that shit will happen. Yo, that's crazy, because I've been thinking of different scenarios that, like, I don't want to be in, and I'm like, okay, what if I keep thinking about this shit, and it actually happens? Every single time I've been scared of something happening, like, worried or nervous about it, that shit happens, bro. I can I can think of like multiple examples, and it might have been happening like regardless, or like 
I brought that shit into existence. I can't tell if that was just my intuition speaking or like my manifestation speaking. Either way, if you're afraid of something happening, that shit's probably gonna happen. That shit's like a red flag right there. It's <laughs> probably just like, granted, you're supposed to not have like any, any fucking like fears about anything, right? Yeah. But at the same time, that shit's, uh, that shit protects you. So it's like, Nah, you're right, bro. You're right. Yeah, man, I'm gonna let you go. I was just, I was in the middle of something. All right, bro. Now keep, keep on meditating. Make sure you put your balls in the sun, okay? Is that like your new thing now? Yes, it is. I'm finna. If, if I have time, we're gonna do it today. <laughs> what? Shout out to Will, man. Yeah, honestly, y'all, it's a good vlog. Um, a little day in the life, you know what I'm saying? If you guys want more videos like this, just let me know, bro. Um, I'm about to go back home and chill because I ain't got nothing else to do, really. So. Yeah.